Peter Chang here, and in this video we're going to go ahead and add some cable management to our DIY computer build. And as you can see here, this is a power supply cable uh, that goes over to the opposite end of the board it is kind of bugging me. So I'm just going to temporarily just go ahead and use the, uh, some twist tie and just twist tie this in. Uh, when I get back into town, I might pick up a extension cable, but for right now, this is good enough for being in the middle of nowhere in the uh, in the camping and building a computer. So with this kind of out of the way, I also have some other wires that are also kind of uh, hindering me from building up my system. So I'm going to go ahead and let me just zoom in here so I could show you like this kind of cluster of wires. Even though we're using a modular power supply, uh, things kind of still get out of control pretty quickly if you're not kind of actively thinking about cable management. So once again, just with a, uh, another twist tie, we could go ahead and uh, kind of contain this mess a little bit better. Uh, once again, if you have a bigger case or if you decide to upgrade from the Antec 900, uh, you also have more choices with the cable management. Uh, it's not to say that the Antec 900 doesn't have any form of cable management. Um, it's just that I was in such a hurry when I'm building this because uh, I was just kind of curious to see if all the parts are working. Actually, the Antec 900 is actually a, a pretty decent case as far as cable management goes, and you can do a way better job than I'm doing here. So I just want you to know that uh, take your time and have some fun. Now, with my video card installed, suddenly my uh, front panel cable wires aren't long enough, so they don't extend all, all the way. So what I need to do is get some front panel extension cables. And luckily, I had uh, a few on hand before I went camping, so I actually brought along a few of these cables because I, I did have a build that that did come up too short with some of these mid tower cases uh, generally this occurs with the with the designs of boards so if you're using an older case sometimes the the front panel wires don't reach all the way and where you could find some front panel cable wires is that you could you could find them in your local computer shop uh, if they don't have them you could always order them in uh, you could also go on Google, do a Google search, and search for front panel cable wires. I actually got mine from a combination of going to the computer store, like at Micro Center or Fry's. Uh, also, a uh, online vendor uh, called Frozen CPU also had some great wires too. And you, if you remember, when I installed originally to the Q Connect, the white wires were the ground wires and with the extension cable wires you notice that the black wires I have a combination of black wires and white wires so uh, just be mindful that you kind of go one for one and and uh, make sure you're you're absolutely positive with the uh, direction so just remember in this one in this case with the extension cables either black or white could be the ground wires as well uh, once again thanks for watching this video and remember, everything matters.